Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? It is the man coming back at it again with another YouTube video, and today we've got gameplay on Lorenzo Neal. So let's go ahead and check him out. Now, if you guys did go ahead and watch the Kyle Vandenbosch gameplay, you guys saw a little bit of a sneak peek of Lorenzo Neal in the lineup, not only in the lineup, but in the gameplay as well. So if you want to go back and watch that video and you have not already, hey, by all means, go ahead. Click off the video. Once you're done watching that one, come to this one. But let's go ahead and check out Lorenzo Neal. So this guy is a massive need for our team. This was a massive need. The position fullback, we didn't have one fullback better than the 76. Kerry Blossom game was our fullback. And I had to use Johnny Smith here. So I do want to go ahead and show you guys his attribute attributes here 91 speed at fullback is great that means he's going to be able to get out on the edges uh, and get blocks look at this dude's just look at his stats look at the back of this card 98 strength 99 awareness which is fantastic which means he won't be running around looking for people to block he's going to know he's going to make a beeline to your uh, if you want to id your dude this dude will make a beeline straight to that dude he is going to block anyone you want him to he is not going to run past anybody. He's going to block, and we're going to see it today. 99 awareness is is it's amazing. Is 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 just amazing. 96 carrying as well. We might be feeding this guy the ball a little bit too. I might put him at running back. I might feed him a, if we get it to the goal line. I'm going to feed him with a you know a little bit of a fullback dive action. But yeah, now 81 catching as well on him is is really nice. 99 run block, 99 lead block, 99 impact block. Oh my. Goodness, this dude is very, very scary, if you ask me. 99 stamina as well, so he's not going to be gassed after, you know, one or two or three plays. He's going to be able to stick in there for a little bit. He's got 80 pass block as well. That is insane. Like I said, 99 run block, so if you want to throw this dude at tight end, hey, it's not a bad look at tight end either, but we would have to get another fullback, obviously. He's a 95 overall at tight end, so he'd probably be about a 97 overall there. Uh, you know, if you wanted to ever throw him at full uh, at tight end, but I probably would never. He's also at a 91 overall at running back. So there's your there's your overalls there. So he's at fullback, uh, obviously a 99. At tight end, he's a 95, and at running back, he's a 91. So yeah, 81 juke move too. Like this dude is versatile, man. 88 stiff arm, 88 ball carry vision, 87 change of direction, 91 trucking. My goodness. This dude can do it all. So, Lorenzo Neal, gameplay. Hey, listen, he is, he played for the Chargers and the Saints for most of his career. I think he started with the Saints about midway through his career, played for the, mo the most with the Chargers. But, hey, I think his best ball was in Tennessee because it was a big reason why Eddie George is Eddie George and where, where Eddie George is at right now. He was a big factor and why Eddie George was so good. I'm just saying, guys. If you go back and watch highlights of the 99 season, 2000 season, Lorenzo Neal, or was it 98-99? I can't remember. I think he played two seasons with us. I can't remember for 98-99 or 99-2000. But I just know he was in that Super Bowl run. Um, I know it was 2000. I can't remember. Or 1999. I can't remember if it was 2000 and 1999 or 98-99. But if you go back and watch highlights of this dude, or if you just go back and watch like the Super Bowl highlights, uh, or from our Super Bowl season in 1999 and just watch Eddie George highlights, you're going to see this dude a lot. This dude was creating massive holes for Eddie George, just like he did any other running back he played for, uh, or he played with, I should say. So, definitely a legendary fullback. Uh, you know, some people put him up there. I don't think he's the great. He's not the greatest fullback of all time, but definitely one of the greatest fullbacks of all time, in my opinion. But, yeah, with that being said, is super excited to have him back into the game. He was in the game, Mad 19, wasn't in the game last year. We were missing that fullback piece last year for our theme team. And thank goodness he has returned to Madden 21 to help out the theme team and get us to 97 overall. So with that being said, he helps us out with the overall. Let's see how he can help us out on the field. I just want to make sure you guys know this. The man that picked it off is the man that makes so many plays. It's Desmond King. Why wouldn't he make another play? And the sad thing about it is, this is his first game since his departure from Tennessee in real life. He just signed a contract with the Houston Texans, so 
they're gonna get a good one in real life and definitely a good one in Madden Ultimate Team. All right, you guys are about to see a freight train behind another freight train. Here we go, Lorenzo Neal. Okay, he didn't really block anyone there. Kind of wrapped around to the, the like sub linebacker there. Might have been Derwin James, but we did. We were able to pick up three. I did take a delay game, but let's see if we can do this next play. All right, we're look, we're going to go ahead and do the same thing once again. Let's block someone this time, Lorenzo. And he's not blocking anyone. Okay, I might have to ID someone. All right, we're going to our one of our favorite, one of my favorite plays in this playbook. It's going to be a little flood action here. So we're looking for AJ. Low ball maybe to AJ here. And we're gonna have we're gonna have Andre. I could've I could have racked that. I was scared though. I could have racked that. Great throw, Dak. Great catch, Andre. Yeah, guys, that would have definitely been a touchdown there. But hey, it is what it is. Let's go ahead and run it again. Derrick Henry, here we go. And we're just just a little slow out there. Derrick said hit that hole a little bit quicker. Uh, you know, part of that's on on Derrick Henry and myself, so. Uh, I'm kind of looking at Lorenzo Neal upfield, see if, see if he's blocking anybody. But let's go ahead and do it again. All right, this time, let's go ahead and ID this right linebacker here, which is his user. And there we go. Look at that block. Derrick Henry reached for it. He's got it to the 13. Yeah, the key there might just be to ID his user, which is going to be this guy right here. See if we can do it once again. Get there. Oh, he runs right past him. Derrick Henry almost got the reach forward animation to the goal line. Here we go. I'm going to run it up the gut. Let's see if we can get a good block from Lorenzo Neal. He's probably expecting it up the gut. And we don't have it. No huddle again. Derrick Henry's going to be absolutely gassed. He's gassed. But come on, Derrick. Just give me a yard. Just get me a yard, Lorenzo Neal. Give me a block. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. That's easy money. Easy money. Touchdown, Derrick Henry. I said if we were going to get in goal line, uh, if we were going to get close to the goal line, I was going to feed it to uh, Lorenzo Neal. But in that situation, I am no huddle in it. I like what formation he's in. Uh, so I just kept him in there the whole way down the field. And we're going to have Greg Joseph kicking the extra point. EA, please give us a, uh, you know, a Guskowski. Please, 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 please give us a Guskowski. For our team builders next series because we really do need it so here is greg joseph kick is up kick is good it's seven nothing tennessee titans all right guys here is a big third down and a short third and four here is going well look it's a four wide he's got an empty backfield but he's got a tight end on the line so i'm not going to send a blitz here i'm just going to watch for anything over the middle Anything over the middle, anything over the middle, anything over the middle. Oh, no, Logan. Or that was not Logan Ryan. Who was that? That's Kenny Vaccaro. Kenny Vaccaro almost had it. Fourth and four. He's going to take his three, which is kind of surprising. Um, but, hey, we'll take it. We will definitely, definitely take it. Okay, he's actually kicking his three. I thought he might he might fake it, but he's got it straight through. It's three to seven. All right, guys, back on offense. We're going to run the same thing. Power O, here we go. Power O, here we go. Derrick Henry reached for it. That's our first down. All right, guys, next play here. We're going to flip the play here. We're going to go to the other side here. Let's see if Lowe can get a block. There goes Zoe. Lorenzo got a pretty nice block. Derrick Henry looks like he has the first down again. Maybe, just maybe. Yeah, Derrick Henry was able to get that first down pretty easily. Let's see if we can do it again. I'm going to run the same play. I'm going to run it to the right side. I'm going to ID the Mike linebacker, his user. We got a good block. If I cut that up the middle, I got a lot of yards. All right, guys, here we go. A minute left in the quarter. I'm going to go right back to the run. I'm going to ID the mic. There we go. ID him. Let's snap this ball. There we go. Good block. Good block. Derrick Henry, get off of me. 50 seconds to go. Hey, it's a Lorenzo Neal gameplay, so we're going to be running that rock a whole lot. So, ID the mic once again. Get some good blocks up front. Great blocks. Bounce to the outside, Derrick Henry. First down once again to the 40. Let's go no huddle. I, that's probably a bad idea, but I don't care. Let's go no huddle. Flip the play. Let's go to the left this time. He's going to be stuck on the lineman. And Derrick Henry gains about four. I'm going to call timeout there. We're going to keep running this ball. I don't care if we got 27 seconds left or 27 minutes left. We're going to keep running this. All right, guys. So here we go here. We're going to run it again. We got 27 seconds left, so we probably have one run play left in us. But can we get a big one? Can we get a big one low? Okay. Derrick Henry falls forward. We're going to have to call a timeout there. Maybe take a couple shots at the end zone here and then maybe just settle for three. 
Alright guys, so we ran this play earlier, so he knows there's a corner route coming, but I'm going to try and sneak one into A.J. Brown and maybe pick up enough to get out of bounds or so. That's what I'm going to look for. Uh, I don't like anything's open. I guess A was open. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to throw this away. Let's just throw it away and maybe have a couple more shots at it. Alright, so if his user goes with that corner, I might have Jared Cook, but it, the question is, will I get out of bounds or will the clock run out of bounds? Uh, out of, will I run out of time? I'm going to, I'm just going to throw this away and take my three. He knows what's coming. I really don't have anything outside of that formation, so I'm just going to take my three here with nine seconds left. All right, so here's Greg Joseph to attempt this 37-yarder. It looks good. It should be good, and it is good. So you guys see, he's barely making 37 yarders. So this dude, is, is his max is probably like 40, high 40s, 45 to 50 range. So that is that is not good at all, but... He's able to knock that one through. We're up seven. Just got to take care of business his last six seconds. We do get ball back at half. So if we can do just that, uh, we can chew off some clock here in the second half. We're looking very nice. All right, I'm recording this. I'm putting this in the video just to make sure. Okay, he's going to run it, actually. So we should be a-okay, make a tackle. There we go. I was recording that just to make sure, like, maybe we got a pick or pick six, something like that. So end of the half, let's go ahead and get the ball back. Let's run that ball. All right, guys, so here we go. The same exact run play. Under center, I mean, this is uh, this is like stretch from last year. This power O. Let me go ahead and, and, and ID the right guy here. So, going to ID that guy, get a block. Derrick Henry is able to fall forward for a couple. All right, we're going to try to run up the gut here. Uh, let's actually ID this guy since this is his user. Uh, and let's see if we can get downhill with it, Derrick Henry. Let's cut it back. Oh, that looked kind of promising, but Chase Young is able to make the tackle there. Gain of four, it's third and four. All right, here we go once again. I'm going power O. Let's go ahead and ID. I want to actually run it left. Let's try running it left here to the weak side. That might not be a good idea, but he's might. Okay, there we go. Blocks up. Oh, we're a yard short. We're a yard short, but that means we're just going to no huddle it and run it up the gut with Derrick Henry. Please, just tell me you can get a yard, Derrick. Just tell me you can get one yard. Unbelievable. All right, guys, a couple of massive stops there. Can we get our adjustments off in time? Yes, we can. So let's see what we can do here defensively on third and 15 at the 38-yard line. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, he's going to take a delay of game. I don't know about that, bud. So third and 20, that might actually push him out of field goal range. But, hey, we'll take it. Third and 20 still. I'm going to flip the play. I want, I want Vandenbosch blitzing off the edge here. Uh, actually, I'll draw him back in zone. Because uh, I want to take away the flats. Um, I actually should just blitz them because um, I've got 30, I got 25 yard curl flats, so they should be dropping back pretty deep. Watch out for any corners. That is not open at all. And it's going to be Rashawn Evans picks it off. We're at the 23, right back in business. All right, might get a little boring, might end up switching things up, but if, if okay, there go Derek Kendrick, another game of five, another game of five. Yeah, I don't care if it gets boring because we're just going to keep doing what we're doing here. Derrick Henry is never going to get stopped again for another like a, a gain of nothing. That's never going to happen. We're going to keep on going here. Breaks the tackle. Derrick Henry to the 38. All right, so here we go. He's got 20 carries for like 100, uh, 111 yards for Derrick Henry. Looking to run it again here. And Derrick Henry crunched up there for uh, gain of two. All right, guys. Oh, no. I didn't mean to put Barry here. I meant to put, oh my God, look at our freaking, <laughs> look at our personnel on the field. We got Janu. Uh, okay, Barry picks up a good gain there. Okay, about four yards or three yards. This is what I was trying to do. Put Lorenzo Neal in the backfield and let him go to work. Up the middle, Lorenzo Neal. Okay, kind of gets stuffed there, but gain of one. We're going to take it to the quarter and decide what we're going to do. I think I'm going to punt the ball. All right, so we're going to punt this thing. Can we get a good punt here? Special wild break, Kern. Go ahead and pin him at the three, baby. All right, guys. So we're going to put some beef out here on the field. We're going to try and get to the quarterback here. I'm going to flip the play. And uh, I got Curse out there, actually. So maybe not the best move putting Curse out there. Underneath, he throws it right to me. But Vaccaro gets it. Can he get up? Okay, no. My God, he's throwing it right at us, guys. All I'm saying, guys, if Derrick Henry gets another 10-yard gain, he's got his he's got his X factor activated. That's what I've been trying to do. But and we trip over our own lineman there and, and lose three yards. 
I mean, a field goal does pretty much ice it here. I'm going to try and go stretch to the left. See how this works for us. So stretch to the left. Got a good block there. Derrick Henry is just not fast enough to get out uh, to the outside. All right, guys. Another run play here. Derrick Henry going to the right this time. Let's see what we can do. Get some blocks up front. Derrick Henry again. Gains three, but, I mean, he just doesn't have the speed to get to the outside. He calls timeout. It's going to leave him with about two minutes and 39 seconds left on the clock here. So it's going to be a pretty chip, uh, pretty easy chip chop here for Greg Joseph. I thought I might jinx myself there, but I did not. Greg Joseph, straight on through. We're going to take a 10-point lead late here in the fourth. All right, guys. He just threw a pick right at me. Is he going to quit the game? Yes, he is. I just started recording there because I knew he was going to end up quitting. So with that being said, that's going to do it. But I want to see Derrick Henry, 24 carries, 116 yards. We will take it. Let's check out Lorenzo Neal one more time. All right, so here is Lorenzo one more time. I mean, nothing much else to say, but this dude just gets the job done. Um, I mean, again, fullback, not the flashiest position, but hey, listen, it was a much-needed position for our theme team. Like I said, our highest overall fullback was Kerry Blossom game at a 76 overall. We had to rock with Johnu Smith there um, for a while. So this was a fantastic upgrade for the theme team, and guys, he, just, he gets the job done on the field, too. So with that being said, Lorenzo Neal is really good. Okay? All right. So with that being said, that's going to do it for the video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. And until next time, I'll see y'all.